I moved over to a PC just so that I could use Camtasia to show you how to use Nimbus, which is a screen recording system that you can use inside of Google. So I show you in another video multiple places to add it, but you have the option here in Google to go into apps, and you can see these are my current apps, but I can go to the web store, and don't worry, it's free, and I'm going to look for Nimbus. And I'm going to add this to Chrome, because I'm doing the video recorder. You might not need that one. You might just want the screenshot master. Though I like all of the Nimbus options, and Web Clipper is probably my favorite. And so those are all parts of Nimbus. And then they'll show up here in the top of the page. And I'm going to show you how to use Nimbus Screenshot. And they have stuff in here to show you how to do it. But what you're going to be needing to do is generally capture a fragment. So you will click on Capture a Fragment. And then you can select which area it is. Otherwise, you may choose Selected Area. And then you can draw a box around what you want to capture. And you can save it. Now, if you save it on a Chromebook, it automatically goes into Downloads. Here, I'm just going to save it in Downloads. And I'll just call it Nimbus. And then you can go over to your downloads on your computer in Chrome, and you can take those images and you can put them into a Google Doc, which we'll be using. So if I were to go into Drive, and for several of our And I need to log in. And it's going to take a moment to finish setting up Nimbus. And then I'll go back to go to Drive. It may do that one more time since I added all three apps. Let's just do it this way. So I want to log into Google Drive, and you're going to be creating Word doc or documents. So I can add a new Google Doc. And you'll have to do this for several of the database portions. So you'll put some sort of description, which you'll be told to do. So I'm just my description is just going to be Nimbus. Let's try that again, Nimbus, and then I'm going to insert an image. And so I'm going to have to go upload from the computer, and on your Chromebook you will be able to find it in the downloads. Here I'm going to do the same thing, it's Windows, it's a little different, um, but I'm going to go into the downloads and open that, and I'll be able to insert the image with that. 
you're going to need to be able to take a screenshot. There are other screenshot programs. You do not have to use Nimbus, but if you don't have one on your Chromebook, it's free, easy to use, and easy to add, and you will need to do screenshots in the database section and for your final exam on database.